in October on the 29th. The next morning, we got our first real look at the utter devastation left behind. News 12's Ty Milburn reported from Stony Point, perhaps the hardest hit community in all of the Hudson Valley. This is devastating. It's bad. I think this is going to be this bad. Homeowners along River Road in Stony Point in a state of shock on Tuesday. Dozens of homes along the river were destroyed by a storm surge brought on by Sandy. It was the wind and the, the water. We didn't get much rain. It's the wind and the water, the surges. They said there was 25 foot waves coming up over this thing and hitting houses. Town officials say this is the worst storm that Stony Point has ever faced. Dozens of residents had to be rescued last night. More than 200 people were evacuated out of the Baymar Mobile Home Park and thousands of people are still without power. The police chief says recovering from all this devastation will take days, if not weeks. Right now, safety is going to be paramount. We have uh, gas emergencies, electrical emergencies, and we have structural damage to buildings. Uh, so we're not going to let anybody in until we make sure that it's safe. Megan Butler lives in Baymar, but this is the closest she's been allowed to get. She says she's anxious to get home ASAP to see what, if anything, is left. I would just like to know if my house is still there. Because I've lived there my entire oh, life. Well, let so, you know, it's just, they're saying you want something to reassure you that your house is still there. And this picture tells another part of the story. The